Warning. The following may upset liberals who don't want voters to know the truth about Kamala Harris. If you ever wondered how Joe Biden could get the border so screwed up, remember, he had help. <laughs> Here's Biden appointing Kamala Harris to be his border czar to deal with illegal immigration. And here are a record number of illegal immigrants, 10 million and counting, flooding over the border after Harris was put in charge of stopping illegal immigration. <laughs> to be fair, Harris got off to a rough start by ignoring the border. Do you have any plans to visit the border? I'm here in Guatemala today I, at some point, you know, I, we are going to the border. We've been to the border. So you, this whole this whole this whole thing about the border, we've been to the border. We've been to the border. You haven't been to the border. I, and I haven't been to Europe. And I, I, mean, I don't I don't understand the point that you're making. <laughs> Harris was liberal on illegal immigration before she ever reached the White House. As a prosecutor in San Francisco, Harris allowed illegal immigrant drug dealers to enter job training and have their criminal records wiped clean. One of the illegal immigrants Harris released went on to steal an SUV and ran down a young woman, seriously injuring her. <laughs> And, of course, Harris backs sanctuary city laws that harbor illegal immigrants, even criminals. She even backs taxpayer-funded health care for illegals, record illegal immigration, special treatment for illegals, taxpayer-paid benefits. And Harris still doesn't get it. I've been working on this issue for a very long time. That's the truth about Kamala Harris. She's dangerously liberal on illegal immigration. <laughs>